you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we got Legends Saturday. We got the brand new Legends now. These new Legends are pretty, pretty cool. Do I anticipate starting either one of them? Yes. I think I might actually pick up both of them. So, as far as the way my team's built, not a breath here. I just ran back into my room. Whew. Let's go make this video. So, there's a lineman and a defensive defensive end. Or I shouldn't say I should say defensive lineman. No. They're really, really good. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna power them up or if I'm just gonna buy them straight out. I might buy the lineman straight out. I might power up the, the defensive lineman now. It's confusing because I don't know how long I'd want these cards for. Because I won't a lot of these legends might not get upgrades for a while. Which is my main concern with most of them. That I don't want to like power them up now. But it doesn't really matter if you power them up because they most certainly will get ultimate legends. So it doesn't really matter if you did go that route. But before we get into this video, boys, if you haven't already, make sure to go down below. Smack the sub button. We're at 7.3k just about. Let's keep grinding out to 8k. Get to that 10k by like the second or third week of September. And then we can work on that 10k subscriber special that I've been telling you guys about. It's going to be hype. You guys are going to want to see it. Trust me. We got a lot of changes to the channel coming in the next few weeks. So stay tuned for all that. Turn on the notification bell to get notified every time I post a brand new video. Guys, I'm still out of breath. <sighs> okay. And make sure to drop a like. Let's get this video to 200. No, it's, it's a content video. Let's get this video to 100 likes. That'd be greatly appreciated since it is a content video. Also, so. Oh, and comment down below what you think of these legends. So the legends are going to be Kevin Maway and Alan Page. So that is a center for the Jets. Awesome center. I really do like that card. Also, we got defensive tackle Alan Page. So, I don't know, which, I think I might actually end up picking up Kevin Maway as a center for my team. Because as you guys can see on this team, we do need Kevin Maway. We do need a center. And we also need defensive tackle. So, we need a center here. So, I might be, I don't know if I want to power him up to an 88 and then just start the 88 Kevin Maway. Or I want to get the defensive tackle and then put him at here and then power him up to an 88. Or do I want to pick up their full cards entirely? Like, I don't exactly know the route to take on that if you guys know what I'm trying to say. Like, I could take either route here. But I feel like the power up route would be like 200k, but then I'm still gonna need their full card. I think for the time being, I'm better off just picking up the full cards of both and then worrying about powering up later if I wanna sell them off or something. Because I definitely could use both of them. Now, Kevin Away looks really, really good, and so does Alan Page. They're one of the better legend drops so far, especially considering there isn't really any like over. There's Matt Burke at center, but Matt Burke's the theme diamond. Like I said, I didn't really mess with the theme diamond promo because, again, these are cards that won't be getting a lot of upgrades. That might be their last card for maybe the rest of the game. Like, even Matt Burke, I don't anticipate getting another card. Unless they do, like, revamp themed diamonds later in the year, you could increase their power-ups. I don't know. But I wasn't taking that chance with my coins, considering my coin count is a little bit lower, considering the teams I like to build. Also, guys, quick little recommendation before we get into these Legend stats. If you are playing Weekend League, be careful, because at the moment, there is, like, a glitch in Weekend League where you play in slow motion. If you haven't already, go over to Twitter and go check out the video I posted. I'm literally, like, if you ever seen The Flash, Barry Allen running through the Speed Force when he's, like, looking in slow motion and everything. I had to play two whole Weekend League games like that, and everyone's commenting on my Twitter saying that that's happening to everyone. I've taken two unnecessary losses, which is so annoying because I was 8-1. It's very frustrating, so guys, I highly recommend you don't play Weekend League right now. Wait till Kralo tweets something about it, or if that's the only time you got, I guess go for it and be, be risky, but I'm not taking that chance right now. Now, let's go check out the, let's go check out the store, see if these packs did come out. So we got the brand new Legend Fantasy Bundle. Like I said, EA is never late for their eight times Legend Fantasy Bundle. They're never late for their $100 virtual packs. Never late for that. We got the Legend Fantasy Pack and the five times Legend Fantasy Pack. So as per usual, you do get more packs by going this route and opening this one from less, but you don't get the 85 plus. So it always comes down to, do you value two extra Legend Fantasy Packs over the 85 plus? It's up to you. The 85 plus could be a great bundle, a topper today to pull Patrick Willis out of. So that's up to you guys. Also, the best days to open bundles are probably on Thursdays and Fridays because you do get the Mutt 10 player and the two signature series. So you get three limited times in pack. So that's probably the best time to ever open bundles, in my personal opinion. Now, let's see if the sets are out for these guys. Probably not because they never are. Let's go to Legends. And do we got, we do not get them yet, but they're probably in packs, right? So let's go check the auction block and then we'll go over their stats. Guys, I'm still out of breath. I hate, I ran up the stairs and I'm talking fast. It's not, I'm not catching it back up. Whew. All right, let's get to Legends. Program, Legends. Let's see if we can see them by new, and if not, we'll just search them out. Actually, I'll look them up by center, and then by defensive tackle first. So Legends center, we only got Bruce Matthews, that's weird. All right, let's see defensive tackle. They might not be up to show, which means I'll take you guys to Twitter. I have 
Um, no, so it doesn't look like we got anything just yet. They should be coming out any minute now. They probably are out. People just have to open the bundles, put them on the, on the block. You know, it's only been like three minutes. That's typically a few more minutes left on that. So I think I'll take you guys over to Twitter in about a second. I'll keep refreshing. But guys, if I had to pick one out of the two to have, I think I'd go with Kevin Mawai first because tip with the way you could play this year, you don't exactly... Defensive tackles are good. They're very important. But right now, my defensive tackles play just fine. So I think I'd rather have Kevin Mawai with the way the running game plays. He has really good run blocking. You power that guy up or you chem him up. And he has maxed up. Threat, like tier one threshold one um where i'm blocking so that's highly important with the way this game plays this year so i think i definitely got to be looking i'm gonna be on the lookout for this kevin mawai as soon as i can possibly buy him okay guys so looking at kevin mawai here he is a 90 overall center he's not up on the block so i want to get this to you guys as quickly as possible so i don't waste any time here so salary cap is 24 which is actually pretty low i mean i don't know about a center but it's pretty low he does have what i thought is the power chem so i guess for centers that's a different type of ability that is usually what arm bar would look like i'm pretty sure He's power up bull. He's going. Well, he's able to be powered up, obviously. He is six foot four with an 88 strength. So that's awesome strength. 80 awareness. Awesome awareness. 87 blocking. 86 pass block power. 87 pass block finesse. 90 run block. 89 run block power. 88 run block finesse. You get the proper chems and you power this card up. He hits the threshold for run blocking, strength, awareness. This is one of the best centers in the game. I imagine his lead block's probably like a high 80 also. This card is a beast as a whole. I highly recommend this card. He is a jet. He is actually now up on the block now that I'm looking at it on the right side. Let's check defensive tackle and let's see his page up. Alan, wow, Alan Page looks old in this picture. So his full card is up. So I'm just going to get to you guys page in a second. But Wade does look really, really awesome. I highly recommend you guys get this card. If you cannot afford him, get his power up card from the Legend Solos. Remember, always play your Legend Solos. You can, If you do them quickly, you can probably get them up on the block for like 10 to 15k. So it's definitely worth it to get that quick coins every time. So that's about it for Mawai. Let's get over to Paige. Now, Alan Page is a 78 speed defensive tackle that is really fast for defensive tackle. He's six foot four, so he is huge. He has that little like arrow forward looking cam. I don't know what that means. Not too good on that just yet. He's six foot four, 83 excel, 85 strength, 85 tackling, 87 play rec, 85 block shed, 82 power move, 88 finesse move. This card is awesome. So if you power this guy up or chem him up properly, he will hit the play rec chem, I mean the play rec threshold, the finesse move threshold, and he's fast as hell. This is going to be a defensive tackle that's practically Aaron Donald or like Reggie White. He's gonna be like a, def a defensive and a defensive tackle. This card is awesome. I really like this card. He's good at run stuff and he's good at pass rushing. This is an awesome defensive tackle. I highly recommend you guys pick him up. I'm going to have to probably get this card and see if he's on the block yet. He is not on the block just yet, but it's, go look at his 83 card when you guys can. It is pretty funny. Let's go back to Kevin Mawai real quick. Guys, these cards are really, really good. I highly recommend all of them. I really like this legend drop. I was kind of hoping we get a Vic soon, but obviously it might be a little too soon for a Vic. Although he was out pretty early last year. Now coming back on over here, as you guys see, the full Kevin Mawai is right here. Let's see what his lead block is now that we're here. I'd imagine it's going to be pretty, pretty good. So I have no concerns with that. Now coming on down to lead block. What are we working with here? Lead block. 90 lead block. So this card's going to be awesome for pulling. Wow, this card's going to be really good. On inside zone, if he doesn't, if on inside zone, if he doesn't get blocked right away, I don't know if this constitutes it's a lead block, but on inside zone, if he doesn't get blocked right away and he goes straight up to the next level, right to this linebacker, that means he's just going to lay them out. I'd imagine, right? Because that means that no one's there. Now look at this Alan Page card. He looks like an old man right here. Look at this. How you know how old he to be in this picture to look like that? He looks like a grandpa. Now let's go to the full Alan Page right here. Let's see what he's looking, what he's working with here. We saw his stats ready. He is up for 800k. That is not too bad. <coughs> Excuse me. Anyways, so it's not bad at all. Um, I'd imagine these cards. If Alan Page, if I had to guess, he'd probably come down to about. I'd say 300k, just about, and same with Kevin Away, maybe even lower. As you see, like Bruce Matthews, they all hit two, mid 200s. They'll probably come down between 250 and 350. Right now, they'll be like at 400k, but they will come down in the time being, especially if they drop any mutt 10 players at defensive tackle or center within the next week or so. That'll definitely be a big, a big against, you know, big value drop for those cards. Now, guys, that is it. That is it for. That is about it for the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to go down below, smack the like button. If you want to show support, like I always say, if you're here still watching and you're a supporter of the channel, you're a loyal sub, you're new, the best way to show support, drop a like. And if you haven't already, hit the sub button to get notified. Hit the bell button to get notified every time I post a brand new video. And make sure to smack the sub button so we can keep grinding out to AK boys. If you enjoyed the content, you want to see more, hit the sub button. Comment down below what you think of these legends. I really do like Kevin Mawai. I don't know, I like both. I don't know which one I like more. Maybe Mawai just alignment and then 
Alan Page is amazing too, though. Guys, that is it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. See you guys in the next video. Peace.